Hey y'all, hey, Missy here. I'm here with our film keychains. Um, I have already pressed one side so I can make the video a little shorter for you guys. So I'm gonna show you how to do it, okay? So we have the film keychain here. You have your box. You have your little piece here. I'm gonna show you what that does in a minute. And then you have your um, film, okay? So I've already pressed one side. They do have a film on them that you have to remove. It is a little bit of a pain, not gonna lie. If you have if you have fingernails, maybe it's better, I don't. But they have a film and you need to remove the film from both sides before you start pressing, okay? So I've already pressed this side and I'm gonna show you how to do this side real fast. Um, you just line it up like this. If you purchase my design, then I will have the correct measurements you need for it on the website um, for ours, okay? Now, I know there's a lot of these films going around now, and but they are not all equal. Some are bigger, some are smaller. So make sure you um, are checking the size if you're getting it from somewhere else. Um, but this design is mine, okay? So um, just flip it over like this and make sure you don't have it in any dirty spot like this one is, okay? Because you don't want nothing on this. So make sure you have a good clean spot. Put you a piece of paper down like so. Um, press 400 degrees, 60 seconds, hard press. Now I'm using my Cricut Easy Press to press um, this. You can use a Cricut Easy Press, you can use your large press. I'm using my Cricut Easy Press because I really, really like to use this on hot days, okay? So um, if I'm only pressing one or two things, it makes it super fast and super easy. It's 94 degrees today here in North Carolina and we're in this huge warehouse and I don't want to use a 16 by 24 heat press and get it all heated up just to press this one item. So, but it's the same process. Even if you're pressing it here with a Cricut Easy Press or you're using your large press, 400 degrees, 60 seconds. Make sure you remove the film, okay, y'all? Sorry about my dusty cricket. Um, I do need to clean up a little bit in here, but who has time for that right now, right? Warehouses are always dirty. Okay, um, this will take a few, a few seconds to cool off, and then I'm gonna show you how to assemble it and work it, okay? Let's remove that. All right, so you wanna remove this as fast as you can so you don't have any ghosting so just take it off as fast as you can and just cool it down okay cool it down it only takes a few seconds to cool down look how cute it is love it so much okay these are pictures from, um, of Gabby and Gabe's wedding that I stuck on there. Okay. So, um, super cute. I will have extra of these. I ordered a whole bunch of them. Um, so, I will have extras. Look how cute. All right. So, Mike's coming back in just a second. He had a cough, so he had to go grab a drink. Um, dust, I guess, probably got in his throat. All right, he's back. So he's holding my camera again for me. Um, now, there's several ways to assemble this. I'm trying to get it to cool down just a little bit more for me. Um, there's several ways. There, you can use your stapler and tape. You can use just a stapler or you can use just tape, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to do, do that. It's really fast and easy. Um, it has this clear piece right here, um, and it's all the way out already when you get it, okay? So, you just take it, and you can um, put, like, a picture further down if you want, but I didn't do that. I left it the way it is. I, I know a lot of ladies, they are just taping around there so it's not on top of the picture, um, but... I know a lot of people are doing the stapler too. Now, I don't know if I have a small enough stapler. I do not think I do. There's a mini stapler 
that you can get that you can staple them like this, but my stapler is big and bulky. So I might not be able to stay, show you the staple way. But anyway, so you just take it, you take a mini stapler and you just staple it, staple it, and then push the staples down. And then you, you can, and then you put a piece of tape around it, okay? And that's all you gotta do. But since I don't have, my stapler is not gonna work, I don't think, um, because it's too big. I can do, yeah, I'm gonna have to get a smaller one and do it. I don't have a smaller one today, so I'll have to order myself one. So I'm just gonna tape theirs. Okay, so just take it like this and just wrap your tape around. And like I said, you can, um, you don't have to put a picture here at the end or you can bring your pictures down a little bit more, but I wanted it all the way. Okay, now just make sure you have that on there good. Yeah, I guess I should have moved it down just a little bit, but there's different ways you can roll it in, okay? You can roll it in by hand once I get it started. Okay, there we go. You can roll it in by hand like this. And the spring on this thing or whatever's in there is amazing. Look how cute that is. Okay? Or you can do it with this little key. So you give this little key to your, um, the person that you're selling it to, okay? And they can use this little key to do it too. Now, I'm gonna tell you something different about our, ours versus other sellers, okay? Our, ours has a flexible, you see this little guy here? A flexible keychain, okay? He is heavy duty. He looks so much better than the little tiny links that is going around. I've been told that the little tiny links that are going around are breaking a little. Um, some of them are, some of them aren't. They're getting tangled up. Um, so I went to my supplier and was like, hey, can we do something about that? And I had this style made for our group. So you're not gonna see this style on a lot of places. They're gonna have the cheaper ones um, than the style I had made. So I hope that you like this style because I love it. It doesn't look cheap. It looks so nice. And I hope that you guys enjoy this product, okay? If you have any questions, please, please let me know. I'm happy to help. And again, I will have um, this design on the website probably by the time you're watching this video. All right, guys. Have a good one. Bye.